Hi there. In this video, I'm gonna share with you how you can belt without straining your voice. The first thing to remember about belting is it's not the same as singing high in chest voice. I am creating another video about singing high in chest voice. I haven't gotten around to it yet, <laughs> but I will be doing another one. Um, but this is about belting. So the technical description of belting is it's a combination of chest and head voice. It's more chest than head voice. It's about 80% chest voice and 20% head. You can go even less, but it is a combination. The reason for that is that the chest voice gives it the fullness and the power and the head voice gives it the clarity and the focus. So actual belting in technical terms is a combination of the two. Full belting in full chest voice can only go up to a certain um, a, a certain pitch, and that's because chest register, chest voice, chest register, they're interchangeable, is about the uh, what your vocal cords are doing as well as where you're pitching and and the the the, the loudness. Okay, so when you're pitching in head voice, your vocal cords become thinner, and that creates head register. If that happens, you are no longer in chest voice, in chest register. So there is a distinct difference technically, physically, and theoretically. Now, if you are serious about singing and you're right at the beginning of your singing journey, I recommend taking my free five day singing course. You can find that in the pinned, pinned comment or in the description. All you need to do is put, click the link there and put your details in, and I'll send that directly to your inbox. If it doesn't come to your inbox within a couple of hours, go into your spam junk, you'll probably find it there, bring it out into your main inbox, whitelist me, make me a contact, and that way you'll get all of the lessons um, directly into your main inbox. If you are further along in your journey, I've got something else for you, so stick around. I'm gonna give you three exercises that are gonna help you to develop a good, strong belting voice, healthy belting voice without straining your voice. Now, I recommend uh, singing down into notes rather than up when you're starting. And that's because when we sing up, we always think about reaching for the notes and we add all kinds of complications like reaching our head back, tilting our head back or looking up as if that's going to help and it actually hinders. So if you keep your head straight, keep a good posture and sing down into the notes, you're going to find it much easier. Once you've established those uh, exercises, techniques, then you can use the same exercise in reverse. The sound is new, it's the word new, and we're going to sing down into it. We're going to start nice and low for those of you with lower voices. New. Now this is actually um, more of a kind of a rock sound, and then I'm going to give you um, a more a fuller sound that's going to help from, for more like R&B, gospel and soul. So this works for rock, pop, um, country. So here we go. New, 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 new. Now don't worry about it sounding nasal as we go up. It will. I'm going to overdo it so that you can establish the sound and hear how it's supposed to sound. It will sound nasal at first, but you've got to overdo it so that you can get there. Once you've then established it, you can ease off and modify the sound. Here we go. So there might be a temptation to sing That's not belting, it's going into your head voice, so that's actually a mix. It's going into a mix, but it's not the, the mix that you want for belting. So we want to land in our chest voice. And again. Keep going. Really high for belting, but you're probably going to be go a bit 
you're probably beyond about now because we're at the we're at the A5, which is really high for belting. It, you're probably not there. If you are, well done. Back down. Make it a slide rather than a jump. Land in your chest voice. is a fuller fuller round of sound like I just said it's more for soul singing um, R&B gospel um, and you can use it in pop and jazz as well and the sound is yo yo it's a, a, a bit like from you know the 80s like hip-hop kind of era yo so you want to make it full and strong so we're going to say it three times yo 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 and yo 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 breathe yo 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 It's really important to have a, a good established head voice before trying to belt because if you haven't you're not going to be able to get the mix so I hope that makes sense it's really important to understand that it's a combination between yes lots of chest voice but the head voice to give it clarity um, so if you are serious about singing and you're not quite a beginner you've been singing for a while and you want some help with this more advanced te techniques then um, I do have a couple of spaces. I'm working with people who have found me on YouTube, so it is possible. I've only got a couple of spaces left, but all you need to do is go into the description and click the link for book a singing consultation. We'll spend about 30 minutes together. We'll have a chat about where you are with your singing, where you want to be. Um, we'll make some silly noises and some silly faces. You can sing a little bit for me. It must be a cover song, um, a verse and a chorus, chorus and verse, depending on the song. And I will listen to you, give you a little bit of feedback and maybe see how I can help you. And if it's the right fit, we could be working together in just a couple of weeks. The last exercise I'm gonna give you is wow. And it really opens that sound up. Wow! That wasn't really about wow. Okay, so we can really get some some fullness of sound in here and some volume because it is a projection exercise. Now, I'm not gonna do the full range. I'm not gonna do it in the full range. I will give you the full range on the, on the keys because <laughs> the sound will cut out in the recording. So let's start here for those of you with lower voices. Wow. I'm in chest at the moment, but eventually when the head voice comes in, you're going to feel the sound being made here. Okay. Rather than here, it's a little bit, it's a little bit nasally, but you don't want it very nasally for this one. All right. It's made here. We don't want anything in the chest. This is high belting, very high belting, back down. Quick. 
So I trust that this video has helped you. If you need to, go back and go over the points again. Remember that you must have a, full, a fully established head voice and fully established chest voice and you must have mastered mixed voice singing before you can go into belting, otherwise you're gonna cause problems. I hope that, the, that you've enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments what has helped you the most, what you enjoyed the most. Share it with someone that you think will benefit. Remember to subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the notification bell so that you get all of my future videos. I'll see you in the next video. video. Stay hydrated. Ciao!